welcome to a new video king kobe here now i promise that we are going to start a virtual dj keyboard mapping series and yes this is it it's finally here but if you are here i'll kindly urge you to subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your notifications so that you will be notified anytime i upload a new video and to all my new viewers to welcome and then make sure you subscribe to my returning viewers thank you for your support and if you are still haven't subscribed please 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 subscribe to my youtube channel now the main business of the day when you open virtual dj for the first time what you want to do is to select an active deck and then also make your pfl that is your pre-fader level active so that you'll be able to pre-listen to a song even before it comes out as master now a little insight in the pfl if you are new to virtual dj so supposing i have my crossfader volume to the left right and then i have my pfl on if my virtual dj audio settings is set to master and headphone it means that in as much as the fader is here i'll be able to pre-listen to the song via my headphone but it will not output to master right same way if i have my crossfader at the right and then my pfl here is on it means that everything i play on deck a or deck one can only be heard through my headphone so that is it now if you open virtual dj for the first time what you what you need to do or what you would want to do is select your active deck and then your pfl and then now load a song right so either you are loading a song to deck a or you are loading a song to deck b right so what we are going to do let me unload it what we are going to do is to map some keyboard keys right to perform those actions so let's get into it so what you need to do is head to settings on your virtual dj click on mappings and then we'll now do it so first i will use tab the tab key just as the previous virtual dj versions had it because i wouldn't want to confuse myself with their configuration so i just want to use the previous versions i mean configurations keyboard configurations so tab i will use that tab key for that and then now for the pfl is just off because the pfl one way or the other is on by default in as much as you can turn it off it's on by default when you open virtual dj or you launch virtual dj so now the pressing the tab key i would want to turn the pfl off so you just type off and the ampersand and select so the select is for the decks the off is for the pfls right so i'll save it close it so now pressing the tab keys you can see that it's switched the decks and also i mean switch on the pfls um to their respective decks so now we have our keys for the pfl and then the select decks what we need to do next is to set our deck load keys you might want to be interested to know this now by default virtual dj has their switch pfls configuration mapped to the alt plus the tilde key on the keyboard i mean the tilde key combinations so since i've used my tab key for that i can delete this one so that this combination will not be valid anymore i'll save it now the next thing is also the deck load keys now by default virtual dj has it set to the control left and then the control right right so what i want to do normally i use l for that so l will load deck a and then shift l will load deck b that is what i do so if you want to maintain it this way that is fine but i would want to change mine to l so i'll first copy this action because i'm not doing anything new right so let me just cut it okay and then l 
and then paste it okay so i'll the l should load the left deck right and um shift l should load the right deck so it means that i'll go and then delete this so i can also test it out so my shift so my l loads deck a and then my shift l will load deck b i might as well just change the configuration for just one key to load either deck a or deck b depending on which deck is active so let me unload this and then we'll look at that one as well so i'll come back and then now choose l and then i'll just type load like that so it means that my shift l is free it can do another thing but I, I would want to unload so let me look at you you doesn't have anything there so i'll use you for the unload and this is unload i'll just type unload and i'll save it right so deck a i activate deck a by pressing tab to switch and then i'll press l it just loads it now i'll switch to deck b and then change the song and then i'll press l and it's loads deck b as well now if i press u it unloads the deck i press u it unloads the decks as well so i'm just trying to change some of the default keyboard mappings to just one key pressing instead of the key combinations right and i want to map as much as i can the corresponding letters so l you know is load u you know is unload right so that is it about it for this episode if this video was insightful to you make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel turn on your notifications and then make sure to share and like my content name is skin kobe and i'll come your way with another video but till i come your way stay safe and make music magic